It's the student section. It's a raucous and unique atmosphere. One million dollar ad slots. Season. Comparisons to the Super Bowl. It's a lot of hoopla for Oregon's quarterback. All right, questions for Marcus. Uncomfortable with cameras, Marcus Mariota is at the center of tonight's college football championship against OSU. Nobody like him has ever led a team for the title. Young poly athletes everywhere. <clears throat> you should take this as motivation and dream big. Mariota in front of all on ESPN accepting the Heisman, the trophy for the most valuable player in college football, becoming the first winner of Asian American and Pacific Islander descent, a football unicorn. Ernie Davis of Syracuse. It's a path Syracuse Ernie Davis first forged a half trophy. century earlier, the, the first African American to win the Heisman in 1961 in the midst of the civil rights movement. Davis, like Mariota, was reserved. So when the running back won the national title games MVP and only white players were allowed at the ceremony's dinner, his Syracuse teammates stood by him and refused to attend. Then in Manhattan 45 years ago, Jim Plunkett broke a barrier again. The Stanford quarterback became both the first Latino American and first Native American to win the Heisman. It's the greatest honor, you know, a college player can receive. Plunkett's road was not paved. Both parents Team were blind. Home. He was San born Francisco into near 49ers. poverty. Way of looking at Jim Plunkett's whole life. Slowed sometimes, but never stopped. Rick but Davis the Super Bowl winner's won. love of throwing got him through college and a hot and cold NFL career Hendrick. that had Ernie many calling him the comeback forgotten. kid. Marcus Mariota, no born in Hawaii, feels um, like a comeback kid. So Polynesian Americans like him graduate from college at half the rate whites do. And as he says, You know, so many times, you know, in Hawaii we're told that, you know, when we don't have the same opportunities that, that some of the mainland kids do. Despite that, decades later, Mariota finally joins Davis and Plunkett. Tonight, perhaps adding one more chapter to the history books. Richard Louie, MSNBC, New York.